For soldiers in support MOSs, performing combat drills and clearing houses aren't their top priorities, but they still need to be competent and capable to take the fight to the enemy if the situation demands. That's where Staff Sergeant Jacob Roach comes in. He's training headquarters company soldiers of the 508th Military Police Battalion in a variety of tasks, from calling in unexploded ordnance reports, type of munition is unknown, to reacting to indirect fire. It's not the kind of training that they do every day. That doesn't make it any less important. Like the Army always says, you're a soldier first. You never know when uh, you could be deployed overseas and, and be engaged in combat. You've got to know how to handle yourself and take care of your battle buddies to your left and right. For Staff Sergeant Roach, sharing his knowledge isn't just something he enjoys. It can prove vital to helping soldiers face future challenges. It kind of gives me an emphasis on what I really like about being an NCO is doing the fact of teaching and having somebody pick up the information that I have. Because some of this information that these soldiers are learning today is going to save their life at some point in time. And if they can pick up the information and teach their soldiers and we can all come home, that's what I want. As long as there are soldiers in the Army, there will be training. And as long as there are NCOs like Staff Sergeant Roach, there will be trained and capable soldiers. For the 5th Mobile Public Affairs Detachment, I'm Army Sergeant Brian Spradlin.